Well, the Ghana Health Service recently announced that uh, the Bono East region is one of three regions that are currently uh, hotspots for uh, COVID-19. This afternoon, we are hitting the streets of Techima and the Bono East Regional Capital to inquire from uh, the residents here what they make of this uh, worrying situation. We want to speak with them and have their take on what they feel about this particular announcement. I am deeply worried because a, a, a disease is quite, quite, quite more or less quite an elusive kind of thing. You hardly see the disease coming. So if you see that there's widespread variation of the uh, social protocols, it gives room for a uh, concern. So I'm, I'm deeply worried. So let me use your credible medium to appeal to all, all and sundry that if we, we try to observe these uh, protocols, obviously it, it will inure to our benefit and it will even impact positively on the local economy and also the, uh, the national economy as a whole. Uh, yes, I'm very worried that Bruno East is one of the hotspots in this pandemic dis disease. I, I think people are not adhering to the protocols of late because um, people don't put on the nose marks of late and they don't do the hand washing. So um, henceforth, or going forward, they should practice the um, hand washing and be putting on the nose marks. Um, yes, my brother, I I read the news online myself, and um, uh, it's a worrying trend. I I was very worried when I I, I saw that 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 news. Um, Techiman has been a major transit point between the north and then the south. Um, that I think is one of the major contributing factors. So now that it's been the major um, major area that is being the, um, affected by the COVID, COVID situation. I think it's, it's a worrying trend for us in the Bono East, not just Techiman, but uh, Bono East as a whole. Whilst these people here are worried at the current situation, they call on authorities, especially the security agencies, to intensify their enforcement of uh, the COVID-19 protocols uh, to help reduce uh, the spread of the pandemic within this area. What I'm saying is that it's like uh, we should, we should, we should enforce the the security service should enforce the people just to obey the, 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 the procedure that like, should be put in place. I think that's my suggestion. So I think the security should also come in to enforce laws so that that will help people put on the note mark so that that will bring down the disease. I think the security service, they should also be up in their game. Those times they got to the road, driving people to wear their masks, you know, caning people, drawing their attention, you know, sucking them from the street to go and put on masks before they come out. I think it contributed to its reduction in the COVID situation in Bunuiz. So I think that the security people should also come out again and then do what they were doing that resulted to the reduction of the COVID situation in Techiman and then in Bono East as well. From the streets here in Techiman, in the Bono East region, my name is Anasabit reporting for Joy News.